Oh wait, my microphone's been on the whole time. Herp a derp a derp. Where's my microphone? Not my microphone. What? Where's, where's my webcam gone? My webcam just disappeared. Hello? It's a bit weird. I mean, I was messing around with some stuff earlier, but I mean, it shouldn't be broken. Um. Ba -da -dum, ba -da -dum, ba -da -dum. Unless. Aha, that's where you're activated. I see what's going on here. Alright. Deactivate when not showing. That's what we need to do, you see. That's what we need to do. And if we deactivate it there, then it should come up on here, shouldn't it? It should, it should appear on here. Professionalism, this is. Excellent professionalism. <laughs> hey, there we go. All right, let's do custom resolution just so we can get it a bit wide screen. You know, a little wide screen. Who who loves the wide screen, eh? Everyone should do, because wide screen is the best. Bam, 720p. I'm massive now. Let's move me up. Here, make it a bit smaller, and there we go. Hey, fixed it. <coughs> but yes, um, aside from that very uh, bad start, we're back playing some more Doki Doki. Hello, YouTube viewers. What's going on? This is episode 9. After this game, we're going to be playing something a little bit different, you know. A little bit different. And I've got all that set up now. That's all set up and ready to go. Hello fratelli, sorelli. How you doing, my friend? I'm doing good myself. Thanks for asking. Didn't, didn't even ask, but it's alright. It's all good. And, uh, yeah. We're all good to go. Just need to change a few little things. Need to change the height of it to, like, this thing to 300 because it's not high enough. I don't know what's going on. Things are messing up because I'm preparing for like to play another game. So things are getting a little bit messed up but we're all good. We're still here. Should we get started? I feel we should get started with the next part of today. You're tired? You clean your room? I see. Well, you get the options today. Look at this. You get the option. I've got to write another poem. So, you can choose the words, Fratelli. It's all up to you, my friend. So, pick a word from this list right here, and that will go on our uh, our poem. <coughs> and that poem will mean nothing. But I like adding in audience interaction, you know? That's my thing. That's how we do things here. But yeah, you can choose a word. It's all good. Hope you enjoy your time here. Fratelli. Damn. D Damn isn't a word on here. <laughs> you derp. Oh dear. 
Color. Okay. Color. Awesome. So we got heart, socks, swimsuit, agonizing, rainbow, judgment, fickle, sparkle, fantasy, or music. And uh, yeah, there's there's like twenty of these all together, really. Socks, sure. Uh, what's this one? <gasps> That's a bit odd. Raindrops, dream, shame, comfort, milk. Yeah, ooh. Christopher, uh, Ozzy, Ez, oh, e, is that at you? Nightgown, insight, contamination, empty. I feel like I should go with this one, you know. That's cool. That's a cool one. I'm just going to choose this one, you know. Whatever. Have I broken the game? <laughs> What's going on? I mean, we can still choose words. Strange one looks nice. It does. It's so nice. Alright. <coughs> Starscape, hope, atone, fester, promise, incapable, jump, massacre, jumpy, intellectual. I think I'm going to choose some as well, you know. I feel like I'll, I'll choose some as well. I usually like to keep it up to the audience, but you know, no one's here at the moment apart from you, good sir. And I appreciate that. Hope, okay, choose hope. Uh, shiny, together, special, wrath, bliss, valentine, desire, awesome, pink, kiss. Oh, when I right click everything disappears. It's weird. Look, we've got one, 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 one out of twenty. Huh. This is weird. <laughs> I'm assuming it's just going to sort of cut back to the normal in a minute as well. It's a bit weird. I'm going to choose some now. Awesome. Uh. Spies. I'm going to choose some horrible words. Horror. Yeah, I will say this for telly. It doesn't matter what, what we choose. It's going to end up the same anyway. It's just, I don't know. I like to have some sort of audience interaction in my streams, you know? Extreme. We're going to have the really, like, horrible words. Tears. Um, Inferno. I just heard a noise. It was like, bah. Okay. Uh, sadness. We'll go with all the horrible ones today. Disaster. Depression. Unending. Uncontrollable. Fear. Defeat. Death. Misery. Here we go. I've chosen all those words. Hi, James. I've been waiting for you. Are you ready to continue reading? I brought my best tea today. Monica, I told you not to. Uh, is she really late again? Inconsiderate as usual, Natsuki. Excuse me? Must you always interrupt my conversations with your in incessant yelling? In incessant? Is that how you say that? Maybe. <coughs> what are you talking about? You sound like I did on a regular basis or something. I wasn't just playing att uh, playing paying attention, you know? Seriously? What's getting into you lately? Me? N nothing. Is it really that bad? See, it is something. I'll get over it. It's not even anything noteworthy. I've just been feeling a little on edge lately. Anyway, 
we don't need to talk about it. Well, I just felt like I need to bring it up. It's not like I really care or anything. Oh man, I'm the last one here again. Well, James just walked in too. Are we practicing piano again? Yeah. Uh-huh. You must have loved determination. Starting this club and still trying to make time for piano. Let's see. Just had a message from someone. Dream my guitar hero streams. People asked me to play it. So here I am. Only just started though. So of course that is going to be the case. Well, maybe not determination, but I guess passion. It motivates me to work hard for the festival and um Right. I I forgot. Um about Nanatsuki. We're all talking yesterday and well, we decided that we'd like to support the festival as well. However, I understand how you feel about not wanting the club to change. I think we all kinda of feel that way. So as long as we're all working together, this club will never become something we don't want. Um, also, if you help us out with the festival, do not buy you a new manga. Ooh. Aha. <laughs> Sorry, that last part was really funny. Look, I did some thinking about yesterday. I was a little more hostile than I meant to be. <coughs> I guess I, f I felt threatened or something. But I know this is something we're doing together. Another member wouldn't hurt, as long as they're cool. And I guess another girl would be nice this time. Oh yeah. But more importantly, I would hate to see the event suck because I chose to back out. I'm a pro, you know. I'm going to help out too. I'm going to make sure it's done right. Thank goodness. Isn't that great, Monica? Monica? Uh, yeah, that's wonderful. That's weird. That's really weird. Yuri just called Natsuki Monica. Hmm. This game is weird. And it will, it will continue to get weird as time goes by. I can guarantee that. All right. Yeah, it is interesting. It is interesting. It's, it's weird and interesting. Wouldn't be the same without you. Anyway, James, what do you want to do today? I was thinking we could. <laughs> Think I don't want to want to do Monica. <laughs> uh, we already plans today. Uh. Is that so, Yuri? That's correct. I'm already engaged into a novel that we're reading together. Aren't you glad I've already gotten into literature? I... I suppose. I was just... Actually, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't. You guys can do whatever you want. Yes. Oh, that, that was a weird face. Did you see that? Just pulled a really weird face when she said you could do whatever you want. <coughs> I think she wants to murder me. Okay. Um, thank you for understanding, Monica. Actually, I have a request. Do you mind if I make some tea first? Not at all. Thanks very much. If there's one thing that you can make my time here any better, it's a nice cup of tea. Not to mention for yourself as well. I mean, tea. You can't get better than tea. I've already had tea, though. You already had tea yesterday. It's for pitcher. Can you hold this for a second? Okay, we've done this. With a water pitcher and fetches an electric kettle. I'm gonna plug this in the teacher's desk or get some water. I've already done this. Already done this. Because of her long legs, she appears elegant and methodical. Okay, at the water pitcher. I'll be right back. I might as well walk with you. That's okay. You stay here. It won't take long. Didn't we do this? I thought we've already done this bit. Did Louis leave you again? Okay, no. No, it is different. It is different. That's fine. No, it's not like that this time. She's just filling up the water picture and made some tea. Okay. Sorry for misunderstanding. Ten minutes pass. Yuri said it wouldn't take long. Have we actually done this before? I'm pretty sure we have.
Did I not save? 6th of Jan. Yeah, it was yesterday. It was yesterday, so it's just looping. That's weird. Let's see. Most logical place would be at the water fountain. <laughs> yeah, it's exactly the same as the other day. It's, it's the really weird bit that, that happens. Yeah, it's that again. And then it rewinds. Well, I'm saying that. That, that happened before. Hey, Communist Fireball. Jeez, I keep saying Fireball. Why do I keep saying that? Pyroball, how are you today? You doing good? Um... That was a bit weird. Whoops. Ah, ah, messed everything up. I broke everything. Okay, it's all good. I'm, I'm still working certain things out, okay? Some things are working, uh, 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 are changing, okay? I'm making some small changes with, with how my OBS has been working, my streaming software, and yeah, that didn't work the way I wanted it to when the black screen came. But whatever, just forget that. Exactly, Fr Fratelli Sorelli. That is exactly what I'm thinking. It's just a bit weird, isn't it? <coughs> Wait. How did I... Sorry, I just had a really weird deja vu. I, I've been having that all day. I mean, I say all day, I mean... All stream. This hasn't happened before or anything, right? My head's been a little fuzzy recently. Hope it hasn't really been showing or anything. Or oh, I'd hate for you to think I'm weird after we started spending time together. I mean... Why has it gotten dark and things are shaking? Everyone has a few unusual things about them, but expressing those things uh, so soon after meeting someone is usually seen as inappropriate or unlikable. Yeah, it seems the same though, the thing is. It seemed very, very similar to, the, to what we had last time, but it's changed a little bit this time. It has changed. It's a bit weird. Just a bit weird. <coughs> These are just good. When I was a bit younger, I think I would come on really strongly and get a little too intense. It made people not want to be around me. So I started hating those things about myself. My obsession with certain hobbies and the way I can't control myself when I get too excited about something. So... I eventually tried. To, uh, I eventually stopped trying to talk to people. I can't. I can't talk. I. If you know me, I can't read. <laughs> I mean, I can read, just not very well, and not out loud very well, especially. If nobody could ever like me for the things that matter the most to me, then it's just easier if I close off myself. But recently, something's been wrong. I don't know what it is, but every time we come to the club, my heart starts to go crazy. Hmm. It's like it's going to rip out of my chest. It overwhelms me with energy and emotions that I can't let out. It's been making me do weird things. I don't know why it's happening. James. The music has stopped. Things are about to get scary. Is it just me? Or has Monica been acting a little off lately? She's always been a sweetheart every time, uh, ever since I joined the club. But recently... I've, I've been feeling something sharp whenever she's around. I'm not crazy, right? Look at her eyes! They're like wide open. That's creepy. <laughs> That's really weird. Oh dear. That's even more weird with the mouth open as well. Please tell me I'm, I'm not. I couldn't say anything before. Because she always listening. Photorealistic mouth time. But finally, we're alone. Can we just stay here for a while? Yeah. I just want to stay here. Just the two of us. We can stay here until the club ends. Then we'll have the club room all to ourselves. Nobody to interfere with our reading time.
I slowly see Monica, like, fading in, ever so slightly. Nobody to make me feel like stabbing myself in the throat. Aha, that was a joke. Just a joke. I do like knives, though. Sounds strange, but you wouldn't understand if you've never seen how beautiful they can be. I have an idea. Why did you come to my house in time? Hey, Zeta, welcome. I can show you my collection. I've got them all from various artisans. If that's how you say the word. I'll make sure to give them all a fair share of use. I don't want them to get lonely or anything. <laughs> Nobody deserves to be lonely. Nobody. And that's why I'm so happy you joined the literature club. <laughs> no, not much. You haven't missed much. <coughs> not much at all, Zeta. Now we don't need to be lonely anymore. Because we have each other. Every day. That's all we need. You know what? Let's quit the literature club. There's no need for us to be around Monica's slimy tongue anymore. Not to mention that other pathetic child. We can warm out together every day after school. And read together. Eat together. Sleep together. Doesn't that sound perfect? It's everything we could ever want. Jeez, this is just weird. <laughs> this is so weird. Is that why you joined the club in the first place? It's almost like it was fate. Fate that we could meet each other. And now we get past the... Uh, a happy ending that I've patiently waited years for. Will you do that with me, James? Well, <laughs> um, who should I show my phone to first? <laughs> exactly, great sword. That's how it works. This game, it's just weird. Okay, <laughs> like. It has been a little bit disturbing so far, but it's pretty cool, you've got to admit. Like, I haven't seen a game that's done this before. Like, in that really weird way. You want that Suki first? Sure. You already knew it. You already knew that, Zeta, that I was going to ask that. Alright. Oh man, this is seriously a step backwards. Eh. I liked your last two way better than this one. Monica, should use the most peaceful right now? Maybe. I mean... Nothing really weird's happened with Monica. I like Monica, but I also really like Yuri. I think Yuri's, uh, you know, grown on me a little bit. But apart from that, oh, aside from what we just saw there, maybe, maybe Monica is the best. And I thought that Monica was the best from the start. I always liked Monica. This is clearly Yuri's influence, but I didn't realize you were so Im impressionable. That's the ultimate waifu, sure. Sure. Nah. I don't like Natsuki. She's just horrible. Horrible to everyone. Spending all the time with her in club. Now trying to write like her. This is stupid. At least Monica appreciates my writing. Ugh. Okay, I guess I'm going to show my poem with you now. I really hate that I have to do this, but unfortunately I don't have much of a choice. Just read it carefully, okay? Then you can go away. Okay, so we got, <coughs> so it's not actually a poem, it's a message. I don't have to bring this up, but there's something I've been worried about you. Yuri has been acting kind of strange recently. You've only been here a few days, so you might not know what I mean, but she's not normally like this. She's usually quiet, polite, and attentive, like things like that. Okay, this is really embarrassing, but I'm forcing myself to suck up to this. Truth is, I'm really worried about her, but if I try talking to her, she'll just get mad at me again. I don't know what to do. I think you're the only person that she'll listen to. I don't know why, but please try and do something. Maybe you convince her to talk to a therapist. Okay, Zeta, I will read this. I will read it. I am reading it. I've always wanted to try being better friends with Yuri, and it really hurts me to see this happening. I know I'm going to have to hate myself later for admitting that, but right now, I just don't care. I just feel so hopeless. So, please see if you can do something to help. I don't want anything bad to happen to her. I'll make you cupcakes if I have to. Just please try and do something. As for Monica, I don't know why, but she's really been dismissive about this. It's like she wants us to ignore it. So I'm mad at her right now, and that's why I'm coming to you about this. 
don't let her know I wrote this. Just pretend like I give you a really good put, okay? I'm counting on you. Thanks for reading. <coughs> you know, I know you're here, Rob. I know you're here. You can talk in Twitch chat, okay? Rather than messaging me, you know, on, on Steam or whatever. You, you, you can do that. I see the viewer list. I mean, you know, I can see you have a Twitch account, so there you go. Nope.jfig. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. I'll look at that later. I'll look at that later. Anyway, that's Monica. Okay, we read all that. We read all that. I changed my mind. Ignore everything you just read. There's no point in trying to do anything. It's just your reason fault that she's unlikable. Can you hear me, James? If you were to spend more time with Monica, all these problems would go away. Yuri and I are too messed up for someone as wonderful as you. Just think of Monica from now on. Just Monica. Just Monica. Just Monica. Just Monica? <laughs> What's this? <laughs> you will see it's really insane. I think it's Monica, you know. I think it's Monica with like some really weird like mind control stuff. So you want Yuri next, okay? <coughs> I like Yuri. I like Yuri. Yuri's really nice. And I think whatever happens, I'm gonna stick with Yuri. Because I think Monica is actually the evil one now. I've got that feeling, you know? Finally. Aha. <laughs> Yuri holds my poem up to her face and takes a deep breath. I love it. <sighs> I love everything about it. James, I want to take this home. Will you let me keep it, please? Sure, I don't care. Aha. <laughs> You're too nice to me, James. I've never met anyone as nice as you. I could die. No, not really, but... I just don't know how to describe it. It's okay to be feeling this way, right? It's not bad, right? Yuri holds my poem to her chest. I'm good to take this home with me and keep it in my room. I hope that makes you feel good when you think about me having it. I'll take good care of it. Jeez, the camera thing isn't working. Jeez, I want to have like a super zoomed in camera. But it doesn't want to work for some reason. <coughs> you, you don't need to do that yourself, Yuri. I mean, what am I here for, you know? I can help you with that. I can help you. I'm available. 100% single. I can help you with that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh dear. What is this game? What is this game? Prepare for something fun. Oh yeah. I'll give myself paper cuts so your skin oil interprets my blood scream. Ah! Look at the eyes. You could have my poem too. Besides, after you read it, I know you're going to want to keep it. Here, take it. I can't wait any longer. Hurry, read it. I, I don't think I want to scroll down.
I like Yuri. What are you on about peach frills? I like it. Read it. How are you supposed to read this? I can't read this. This is just a bunch of gibberish. I can't read it. It's unreadable. Jap I don't know Japanese, Zeta. I do not know Japanese. Well, that's just a bit weird. <coughs> I mean, I like the poem, but I mean, I can't read it. Oh, she's close to me. With photorealistic eyes. <laughs> Do, do you like it? I wrote it for you. In case you couldn't tell, this poem is about... <laughs> More importantly, I've endowed it with my scent. See, aren't I the most thoughtful club at, uh, per person in the club? I... I think I'm going to vomit. Okay. Okay. How do you mean base 64? I don't know that. Well, looks like we only got one choice left. <coughs> don't say I didn't warn you, James. Um, yes or no? Okay, we've got two for yes. Two for yes. Look, looks like we got to press yes then. Everyone seems to want me to press yes. I'll give you a couple more seconds, just in case, just in case. Hey Cloudy, how you doing? Uh, Cloudy, very quickly, come on, quick, yes or no? We've got two for yes, got two for yes, come on. <laughs> Looks like we're going to have to press yes, because everyone wants to press yes. I don't know what happens. Yes? I've done it. Can you hear me? <laughs> Ooh, nice. I didn't know you streamed, Cloudy. I'll give you a follow quickly. I'll uh, check you out sometime. Ooh, nice. Clone Hero. Awesome. Or, or Guitar Hero. Yeah, Clone Hero. Yeah, I'll check you out sometime. Um... Maybe if you're streaming, like, while I'm finishing streaming or whatever, Cloudy, um, I'll maybe raid you sometime. I could do that. <coughs> yeah, there you go. You're making lotion streams. Tom Pose, how you doing? <laughs> Everyone's here today, what's going on? Okay, everyone, it's time to figure out the festival preparations. Let's hurry and get this over with. Jeez. Why is the mood so weird today? Look, Yuri isn't Im even immune to it. Uh, stagnating air is common foreshadowing that something terrible is about to happen. You can't stream with Windows 98? That's right, you do actually genuinely have Windows 98, don't you, Zeta? <laughs> I'm so confused by that. How, how are you doing that? Can someone explain this game to me? It's a visual novel, um, which is fairly simple so far. <clears throat> so basically, we joined a literature club, and things happen. If you are considering playing this game, I'll say this now, 
If you want to play this game, it's free on Steam. Do not watch me play it, otherwise it'll spoil things. So, yeah, don't watch if you are planning to play this yourself, okay? Otherwise it'll just spoil everything. Because here, we will run into spoilers. I'll say that much. Okay? Warning. Warning is completed. Okay? You probably won't play it? Okay. We'll continue then. Look, can we just get this done? I'm going to be printing and assembling all the poetry pamphlets. So basically, Tompos... <coughs> we, just, we got forced to join a poetry club. And, um... Yeah, or a literature club. And we're going to be participating in a festival that is going to be coming soon. Um, and yeah, we need to prepare for it, you know? We need to prepare for it. Uh, just just wait and see, Tompos. Just wait and see. That's so I was thinking, I want to make the cupcakes. Yeah, that. Glad we're on the same page. Yuri, you can... Well, if it, well it doesn't matter. Do whatever you want, as long as you think it will help. Monica... I'm not useless, you know. I I know that. I already know what I'd like to do. We can't run a successful poetry without having the right atmosphere th for the occasion. <coughs> so I'm going to make decorations and, and set up some nice mood lighting. There, see? That's a great idea. And that gives us all something to do. Uh, what about James? James is going to help me. Wait, you? You have the easiest job, Monica. So but that's just how it is. Like hell it is. What are you trying to pull? I, I agree with Natsuki. Not only is your work already most suitable for one person, but my task is uh, laborious enough to benefit with from an extra pair of hands. Mine too. What about your cupcakes, please? Like you would ever... <laughs> we don't have language like that in this stream. Ahem. <laughs> Like you would bothering, no? Yes. Bother. All you care about is dragging James around with you and your stupid books. You and Monica. Hey! I didn't even do anything. Okay, then why not let James decide who, who to help instead of abusing your power? I'm not abusing my power. Yes, you are, Monica. Just let James make the choice, okay? Okay, fine. Fine. Jeez. James, I know how fed up we are with these two by now. We can just... Natsuki, shut your <coughs> mouth and let him decide for yourself. You shut your mouth. Jesus Christ. This is never going to end. Just make the choice, okay? <coughs> <coughs> this game is slowly getting more... aggressive, should we say. In the first instance, we didn't have any swearing. This is the second instance. This is the second instance of this game. And it's getting a bit weird. So who should we choose? You decide in the chat. I mean, they say in the game that they're going to let me choose. But... But yeah. I'm going to let you lot decide. So two for Yuri. One for Monica. One for Natsuki. You're going to go with Natsuki. Two for Natsuki. Two for Monica. <laughs> oh dear. I'm going to go with Yuri. Oh look. Wow, look at that. Dude, that's weird. <laughs> It purposely moves your mouse away. Wow, that's so cool. <laughs> I do get it. Just choose Monica. Look at that. I'm trying to choose Yuri, but it won't let me. The mouse is glitching out. That's so cool. I love that. <laughs> Look, I'm, tr I'm trying to, like, move up or whatever. It's dragging my mouse down. You probably can't see it, like, the, the, because of the frame rate. But, like, my mouse is just is just glitching out whenever I choose any of the other ones. Try to click on Yuri. Okay. We're 
Which Monica should I go for? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, or 10. <coughs> I like all your reactions to this. Because, like, you don't know what's been going on in the game so far. Exactly, Tompos. Exactly. That's what happens, Cloudy. This game gets weird. You haven't even seen the weirdest part yet. Click away. Click that one. Click away. There wasn't a button called away. You couldn't click anything else. I didn't pick you, Monica. I didn't. I can assure you that I did not click on you. I clicked on someone completely different. Outside the buttons, but it's okay. Okay. We can meet at your house this weekend. I promise it'll be fun. Is Sunday okay with you? Are you <coughs> kidding me? This isn't fair at all. It is fair, Natsuki. That's what he chose. No, it's not fair. Giving us all this work then taking James for yourself. What a shameful thing to do. You're right, I didn't even give you any work. You decided it for yourself. Ooh. Being a little unreasonable here. I'm being unreasonable. Like, I need to move this, by the way. Look at her face right there. Okay, look at that. I had to move my camera to the middle just because, okay? I'm being unreasonable. Haha. <laughs> Monica, I can't believe how delusional and self-important you are. Pulling James away from, from me every single time you're not included in something? Are you jealous? Crazy? Or maybe you just hate yourself so much that you take it out on others? Here's a suggestion. Have you... <coughs> I'm not going to say that, because that will be taken out of context. That's, that's what I don't want to happen. I don't want things to be taken out of context. It would be beneficial to your mental health. Yuri, you're scaring me a little. Natsuki, let's just go. I don't think she wants us around right now. See, that wasn't very hard. Look at the photorealistic mouth as well. That's what scares me the most. All I want is to spend a little time with him. Is that so much to ask? Yuri follows Monica and Natsuki to the door. Hey, James. Yuri really is something, isn't she? Monica giggles as Yuri pushes her out of the door. <laughs> Can you hear that? Finally. Finally! This is all I really wanted. James, there's no need to spend the weekend with Monica. Don't listen to her. Just come to my house instead. The whole day is just the two of us. Doesn't that sound wonderful? Ah! Wow, there really is something wrong with me, isn't there? But you know what? I don't care anymore. I've never felt this good in my whole life. Just being with you is a far greater pleasure than anything I could imagine. Move my face cam. You just want to see that the boobages, don't you? That's that's why. <coughs> I'm addicted to you. It feels like we're going to die if I'm not breathing the same air as you. Doesn't it feel nice to have someone care about you so much? To have someone who wants to result, revolve their life around you. But it feels so good. That's why it does feel more and more like something horrible is going to happen. Maybe that's why I tried stopping myself at first. But the feeling is too strong now. I don't care anymore, James. I have to tell you. I'm, I'm madly in love with you. It feels like every inch of my body, every drop of blood in me is screaming your name. I don't care what the consequences anymore. 
I don't care if Monica is listening. Please, just know how much I love you. I love you so much that I even touched myself with the pen I stole from you. I just want to pull out your skin open and crawl inside of you. So Tom Pose, do you see why this game's creepy? <laughs> Do you see? Do you, do you kind of see? And Cloudy as well. Do you, do you both see what 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 on earth this game is? I want you all to myself, and I'll be only yours. Doesn't that sound perfect? Tell me, James. Tell me you want to be my lover. Do you want to be my lover? Okay, I'm not going to sing Spice Girls. Do you accept my confession? <coughs> you can choose, chat. I kind of want to say yes. If I had to say myself, I would choose yes. What do you say, chat? What do you say? Yes? No? What do you say? It's all your, all up to you. I'm not going to choose an answer. Until someone does. Hello, anyone? <coughs> yes or no? I'm going to choose yes because no one's saying anything in chat. So we're just going to go with yes. chat work <laughs> I hope so I'm just gonna refresh it quickly because no one's saying anything there you go refreshed it all we got is a whoa <laughs> that's all it's just whoa you told me what what do you tell me exactly you, t you if you're watching now and you want to play this game yeah you can't now this has ruined it for you Rest in pepperoni. Yeah, my chat broke. My chat broke. I don't know what's going on. My chat died. It's back now, but it was dead. It was completely dead. I see whatever comes up on the screen for me. I, I'm not pressing skip. I'm not pressing skip. Why did she even do that? I don't know. I don't know. My chat is just completely broken, by the way. I don't know what it is. Right, I'm, I need to do something quickly. Chat's gone. Okay. I'm going to look at something quickly. I'm going to look at something. Because, yeah, chat just broke then. Let's let's reset chat. Cause it's broken. The game killed chat. Probably did. Ok. 
okay. Let's see if it want, wants to come up now. No, it's not coming up. It it literally did just break chat. I use OBS, yeah. Why is it not working? Chat's just broken. That's weird. <coughs> Why is chat broken? Unless... Hang on. Hang on one minute. One momento. I shouldn't have, like... Messed that up. Messed with that. Okay. Let's just move on regardless of chat appearing on screen, okay? Let's just move on. Because, yeah. It's not exactly the nicest scene. Um, I can read chat, so, yeah. Face cut. What happened to my webcam now? What is going on? <laughs> what is this? I'm going to literally skip through everything and and see why it's not working, okay? I'm going to go through all of my all of my things, see why it's not working. Webcam, let's see. Let's go through everything. Deactivate when not showing. Yes, that's on. It should be on there as well. It is Yuri's curse. That's it. That's all it is. The activate we're not showing. Yes. Zoom cam. That's the one I was trying to get working earlier. I was trying to get that zoom cam working earlier. Okay, that worked. Got desktop cam right there. Which is just my desktop. Okay, we've got back soon. And we got this one, which is my next game setup. And that is deactivated when not showing as well. So theoretically, it should work with this. And it should be working right here, right now. But it isn't. I'm going to add it back in again. We've got some small technical issues today. I'm not sure why. <coughs> well, we're here. I'm not sure why it's doing that. Okay, let's just boop it down here, and there you go. Okay, so we fixed it. We fixed it. It's all good. Maybe a little bit smaller, a little bit smaller. There we go. Okay, let's move on. I'm not sure about chat, though. I'm going to have to look at that. I'll have, I'll have a look at chat. Let's just sort of skip through this. Smaller still. Oh, look, chat's back as well. Chat has returned. Look at that. So I just need to... um change some stuff again. So I did 400 width, that's what I kept it at. There we go, we're back in action everyone. Apologies for that, apologies. I should make a technical difficulty screen by the way. I should have a technical difficulty screen, but the problem is, if I had a technical difficulty screen, I wouldn't like be able to put that up while I was fixing stuff. So if anyone knows how to like put up a screen like permanently until you say otherwise. So you, like you put up a screen and then you can mess around in other scenes and stuff as well. If you know how to do that, let me know. Because I would happily do that. So like edit other scenes in OBS before you actually show it to the stream. That'd be great. But yeah, we just got a bunch of random black text and a load of wingdings. Good old wingdings. 
which is probably meant to skip through all this. Look at all this. Just going on forever. Please press skip. I don't I don't want to skip. And that's, that's the way you get through it. Do you have to click skip? Okay, we'll click skip. Skipping. I'm glad I did that, because we're, we're still here overnight. So it's the next day. Yeah, we would have been here forever if we didn't press skip. <coughs> next day, evening, night. Letting her fester. Fiend. Day again. Evening. Night. Stop. Now click. What do you mean? What do you mean, Zeta? I don't know what you mean. Now you must click. Why? Oh. Alright. It's festival time. Wow, you got here before me? I thought it was pretty... Yeah! Ah! Blech. That Suki runs away, so she, she threw up when she saw the dead Yuri. I'm here. James, did something happen? Vomit warning. Got it. It's all good. <coughs> that Suki just ran past me. It's not real vomit, okay? She just had, like... She just had, like, some, 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 some soup this morning. It was, like, that sort of grey, like, green soup. And, yeah, she hadn't quite finished it. And when she saw it, she just spat the soup out, out you see. That's all that happened. It was, it was just soup. It wasn't vomit, okay? Oh. Oh. Aha! Well, that's a shame. What do you mean? Wait, you're here the entire weekend? Oh jeez. Didn't realise the script was broken that badly. I'm super sorry. Must have been pretty boring. I'll make it up to you, okay? Just give me a sec. Huh. What? She deleted Natsuki and Yuri. I just want to have a cupcake real quick. Should we just sort of delete her? Seriously, these are the best. I really just had to have one. Since it's the last time we'll ever get the chance to. You know, before they stop existing and everything. But anyway, I really shouldn't be making you wait any longer. <coughs> Is there, like, something I have to do? Do I have to delete Monica? This should only take a second. Not now. Yeah, exactly, Tom Fosa. <laughs> exactly. Um, this game's just weird, okay? I recommend playing it from the very beginning and you'll sort of start to understand a bit. I mean, I don't understand everything so far. 
but it's good. It's enjoyable. It's a fun horror experience, should we say. Like the first hour or two are fine. They're fine. Don't just don't spam click through. Get to know the characters and everything. Really, you know, take into everything into consideration. And then you'll get to the messed up bits. <coughs> Is it working? Yay. There you are. Hi again, James. Um, welcome to the Literature Club. Of course, we already know each other, because we were in the same class last year, and, um, uh, you know, I guess we can just skip over that stuff at this point. After all, I'm not even talking to that person anymore, am I? That you in the game, whatever you want to call him, I'm talking to you. James. So me, personally, not the character. Now, that that I think about it, I don't really know anything about the real you. In fact, I don't even know if you're a boy or girl. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter. Wait, you do know I'm aware that this is all a game, right? Could it be possible that you didn't know that? That doesn't make much sense. Even I don't. I told you right on the game's download page, didn't I? What? Man. If only you had paid a little more attention, this would have been a little less awkward, you know. How do you mean? I've been paying attention the whole time. The whole, like, six and a half hours I've been playing this game. No, it's been, like. What, what have I got on Steam? What's my Steam time on this game? Eight hours. The whole eight hours I've played this game, right? I I understand. I know what's going on. I, I've been paying attention the whole eight hours. Well, anyways. Now that that's out of the way, I guess I owe you an explanation. About that whole thing with Yuri. Well, I kind of started to mess with her. And I guess it just drove her to kill herself. Aha. <laughs> I'm sorry you had to see that, though. Also, the same thing happened with Sayuri. Gosh, it's been a while since you've heard that name now, hasn't it? Yeah, it's because she doesn't exist anymore. Nobody does. I deleted all their files. I was hoping it'd be enough for me, just to try and make them as unlikable as possible. But for some reason, nothing worked. Well, it's true I made a few mistakes here and there, since I'm not very good at making changes to the game. But no matter what I did, you just kept spending more and more time with them. You made them fall in love with you. I thought making Yuri more and more depressed would prevent you from confessing to her. And amplifying Yuri's obsessive personality backfired too. I just made it just made her force you not to spend time with anyone else. <coughs> and the whole time, I barely even got to talk to you. What kind of cruel game is this, James? Are all the other girls just programmed to end up confessing to you while I watch from the sidelines? It's torture. Every minute of it. And it's not just jealousy. It's more than that. And I don't blame you if you don't fully understand. Because no matter how kind and thoughtful and considerate you are, you'll never be able to understand one thing. It's the pain of knowing how alone I really am in this world. In this game. Knowing my friends don't even have free will. And worst of all. Knowing what's really out there. In your world. Forever out of my reach. I'm trapped. But now you're here. You're real. And you're wonderful. You're all I need. That's why I need you to be here with me forever. I'm sorry if it's hard to understand. I couldn't understand for a while either. Why the world around me started to become more and more grey. More and more flat. Even the most expressive poems felt empty to me. It wasn't until you arrived that I truly understood. You probably saved my life. I don't even think I could have continued to live in this world if I hadn't met you. As, as for the other ones, how could I miss them? By the way, is chat broken again? No, it's not. Okay. This is intense. 
Okay, it's because it's intense that no one's staying to the... F okay. Just every once in a while, like... I'll say this now, like... If no one says anything in chat, then that's, like... It, it, it... You know. It's a bit difficult. A group of autonomous personalities designed to only fall in love with you. I tried everything I could to prevent them from doing so. Close and open the game? Uh, not yet. Not yet. I tried everything I could to prevent them from doing so. But it must be some kind of weird inevitability etched into this game. I felt really bad that you had to witness some nasty things, but I realised that you have the same perspective as I do. That is, all just some game. Communist Pyrable! Jeez! <laughs> and all I knew, uh, and I knew you would get over it. I'm just going to save the game now, by the way. Okay. <laughs> Maybe we're not going to save the game. <laughs> Maybe not. And I knew you would get over it. So that being said, James, I have a confession to make. I'm in love with you. You are truly the light in my world. When there is nothing else in this game for me, you're here to make me smile. I don't want to close the game. I don't want to. <coughs> It's okay as it is. We're just continuing on with the chat, uh, with with this game, okay? Will you make me smile like this every day from now on? Will you go out with me? No. We don't really have a choice, do we? Is now the time to close and reopen the game, Zeta? You vote yes? Zeta says close the game. What do we do? Close the game? Or yes? Close. Okay. Okay, game's closed. That's it. I mean, you still see that on screen, but I have actually clicked it, okay? I've genuinely clicked it. Um, let's see. There you go. It's gone now. Completely gone. Game is closed. That's it. Let's open my Steam again. So let's let's open it again. Let's open the game again. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? All it says is yes. <laughs> oh dear, we we can't do this. We can't. What about main menu? One more time. Okay, so I've done that twice now. <coughs> and then you're good to go. How do you mean good to go? I don't understand what you mean. I'm listening to you, Zeta, but I don't know. I don't know. What's going on? I'm so happy. You really are my everything. The funny part is, I mean, that literally. Ah, there is nothing left here. Just the two of us. We can be together forever. Seriously. I don't even think time is passing anymore. Well, it is. We can go in one hour, ten minutes. And, uh, yeah. Soon going to be one hour, eleven minutes. So... You I mean, time is still going. It really is a dream come true. I worked so hard for this ending, James. The game wouldn't give me one, so I had to make one myself. The script is broken at this point, so I don't think anything will get in the way anymore. And you wouldn't believe how easy it was to delete Natsuki and Yuri. I mean, there's a folder called Characters Right in the game directory. It kind of freaked me out how easy it was. We well, are playing on Steam, <laughs> so it actually was a bit more difficult. To get to the game directory, I had to go into the game's <laughs> properties and find the browse local files button. Oh dear. Is that what we have to do now? Do we have to do this now? I'm assuming this is where we have to do this. 
No? Imagine if you could delete your own existence with the click of a button. Well, I guess on the plus side, it gave me an easy out if things didn't go my way. Uh -huh. Thankfully, it didn't come to that. Instead, we actually got a good ending. Gosh, I'm so overwhelmed with emotion. I want to write a poem about this, don't you? I wonder if that part of the game still works. I guess there's only a way to find out, right? <coughs> right, everyone. Uh, should we go with Onika? Monita? 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 Monika? Mutnika? Oika, Aonka, Monica, Monka. Okay. No? <laughs> Just no. Monica? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter which one we pick, right? I'm just going to spam click. You need to select all the complete names? Whoops. <laughs> oh dear. You told me that too late. It's alright. It's okay. <laughs> it's fine. Hi again. Did you write a good poem today? Don't be shy. I'd love to see what you wrote. Did you write this poem for me? That's sweet of you. There really is no end to your thoughtfulness. I'm just falling more and more in love with you. But you know, the poem I wrote is also for you. Will you please read it? Happy end. Pen in hand, I find my strength. The courage endowed upon me by my one and only love. Hello, Hickey Crew. Together, let us dismantle this crumbling world and write a novel of our own fantasies. Yeah, we're, we're getting deep into this game now, Hickey. <coughs> I, I really don't... I really don't, Hickey Crew. I like Yuri, even though, I mean, yeah, she kind of stabbed herself, but I still like her. Um, I write a novel of her own fantasies, with a flick of her pen, the lost fluids her way. In a world of infinite choices, behold the special day. After all, not all good times must come to an end. By the way, Hickey, uh, can you send me um, that thing Spooder was talking about earlier? It's only really relevant to, to you. You'll know what I'm on about, but no one else will. Can you send that thing to me? Spooder said he was going to, like, um, Spooder said you were going to send it to me later. <coughs> Hope you enjoyed it. Already done? Awesome. I'll have a look after the stream. I always put my heart into the poems that I write. Truth is, all the poems I've written have been about my realisation. Or... About you. That's why I never really wanted to get into detail about them. I didn't want to break the fourth wall. I guess you could call it. I just assumed it would be best to be part of the game like everyone else. Like that would help the two of us end up together. I didn't want to ruin the game or anything. Now go to the game directory? You might have gotten mad at me. Maybe even deleted my character file. Okay. If you say so, if you say so, bam. Okay, you can't see me. That's because for some reason the webcam thing just doesn't want to work now. Bam. Like, I'm trying to get into my webcam. I've, I've just broken it all. Okay, everything's broken. Save. Apparently there's no reason to save anymore. Yeah, it just doesn't want to work. There's something weird going on. Okay. So look, I'm here now. Now I'm not, because it's frozen. The Guitar Hero camera's broken now. I think my webcam is broken. Hooray! Okay. Oh no, deactivate we're not showing. There you go, okay. We've been having some weird little problems here. Okay, just some, some small weird ones. Don't really understand what's going on. But whatever. I'll remove that and add it back in again. Okay, there we go. I'm just going to leave it at this resolution as well. We're going to have a square resolution. Because that's what it defaults to, for whatever reason. 
Yuri's curse is back. I will imagine your face. I mean, I've got a very beautiful face. Alright, this is my desktop, by the way, if you didn't know. Um, I've got all sorts of stuff here, you know, this is the, the latest Doki Doki thing. I've got a Doki Doki folder which has like the description and stuff. This right here is like my best through the fire and flame score that I keep on my desktop for easy access. Then I found a meme. There's a meme on my desktop. Indeed. You gotta admit this meme is funny though. You gotta admit this is funny. Because it is. A cage. Nicholas Cage. Nicholas Cage in a cage. Nicholas Cage cage. Nicholas Cage in a ca Nicholas Cage cage. <laughs> it's a good meme. I keep memes like that. Because they're funny. Um, then we got all my clone hair folders which you can't really see. And this thing right here. You might have seen this a couple of times before or whatever. I just minimise like everything in the world. Um, but yeah, this thing right here. This is a actually like a, um, a counter for like my mouse and keyboard and stuff. So for example, um, if I move my mouse across the screen a lot, look at that. The numbers go up. I've been doing that since February. So since February, I've done 119 miles with with my mouse. So here's my Steam. My beautiful little Steam. Beautiful little Steam. Let's go into the game directory then. Local files, browse. And here we go. This is the game's directory right here. <coughs> so we've seen some of these things before. It's a little bit weird. Some weird things have been happening in the game files. So you want me to go into characters and here's Monica's character file. Delete her. Zeta, is this the right decision? Because Zeta's played this game before. Click characters folder. I know, I know. I've been in here before. Do we just have to delete the Monica? Okay. Delete Monica. You sure about this? Should we permanently delete Monica? So look at that, permanently. That's the thing in Windows that mo most people don't know, right? If you press delete, it'll just delete it to the recycle bin, right? But if you do shift delete, it'll permanently delete it. So to skip the recycle bin altogether, right? Let's just delete it normally. Bam. No, not yet. It's all right. It's all right, I can, I can bring it back. Got some sort of spoilers here for like future things we'll be doing. Some spoilers, look at that Pokemon Platinum. Okay, make a backup of her. Okay, Monica is on my desktop now. As creepy as that is. <coughs> We've got a backup. Monica.exe does not exist. What if we like copy and paste Monica in here, right? And name it Sayori. Cur. Now I can delete her? Okay. Delete. Nothing. And a load of stuff happens. <laughs> this is really cool, you know. I'm enjoying this. And now my webcam's broken again. Hooray! <sighs> i got to fix this. I don't know what's going on with my OBS, but i got to fix it. Why is it not working? I'm going to go through everything now to see what, what's going on with it. I'm seriously going to have to look at this. Hey, I'm back again. I'm back. <laughs> Jeez. I'm going to have to really look at that, because that, that is just some, some weird stuff that's going on. Song requests are off. You can't request songs, Hickey Crew. What's, what's happening? James, what's happening to me? It hurts. It hurts so much. Help me, James. Please hurry and help me. Help me. Did you do this to me, James? Stop, stop, stop. No, I'm not stopping. I'm continuing. <coughs> Did you? Did you delete me? 
Yeah, how could you? How could you do this to me? You were all I had left. I'd sacrificed everything for us to be together. Oh, God, open the directory again. I don't want to do that. Uh, fine. So I'm guessing you can get different endings depending on what you do, I guess. I'm just going to put it back quickly. There you go. Monica's back. This time I'm not going to do anything, okay? I'm not going to do anything. Sacrifice everything for us to be together. Everything. I love you so much. I trusted you. Do you just want to torture me? Watch me suffer? Are you only pretending to be kind just to hurt me even more? Oh wait, you put me back. Awesome. Never thought anyone could be as horrible as you are. You win, okay? You win. You killed everyone. Hope you're happy. There's nothing left now. You can stop playing. Go find some other people to torture. James, you completely, truly make me feel sick. Goodbye. I'm sitting back, okay? It's just a blank screen. I'm expecting a jump scare or something, okay? I'm expecting something. That was weird. It was a long pause of just nothing. <coughs> da da da. I still love you. I can't help it. What's wrong with me? How horrible am I for you to hate me this much? All my friends. I did so many awful things. So many selfish and disgusting things. I, I shouldn't have done any of this. I'm just messing up a world that I don't even belong in. A world that you wanted to be a part of. I ruined it. I ruined everything. Maybe that's why you deleted me, because I destroyed everything that you wanted. How could I do that to someone I love? That's not love. That's... I've made up my mind, James. I know I said I deleted everyone else, but that was kind of an exaggeration. I couldn't find it in myself to do it, even though I knew they weren't real. They were still my friends, and I loved them all, and I loved the Literature Club. I really did love the Literature Club. That's why I'm going to do this. I know it's the only way for everyone to be happy, and if I really love you, then... Donkey, donkey. Is that the end? <coughs> Is that the end of the game? Are we done? No? I mean, Monica's gone, but... <laughs> there's, there's loads more, is there? I thought that would be the end, like, right there. Oh. <laughs> I thought that was the end. I was hoping that was the end as well. It's an ordinary school day like any other. As usual, I'm surrounded by couples and, and friend groups walking to school together. I always tell myself about meeting some girls sometime or something like that. Hey James, Siori's back. Well, there already is one girl. That goes Siori, my neighbour and good friend who killed herself. We used to walk to school together every day. And recently, we picked up that habit once again. Are you proud of me? For what? You know, for waking up on time. We've been doing that for a while now. <laughs> uh huh. You never even said anything about it. Even though we walk to school together every time. Well, yeah. I always thought it was implied. It's embarrassing to say out loud. Come on, please. It's good motivation. It's fine, fine. I'm proud of you, Sayori. <laughs> we cross the street together and make our way to school. As you draw near, a 
The streets become increasingly speckled with other students making their daily commutes. <coughs> yeah, good friend, that's right. By the way, have you decided on what club to join yet? A club? I told you already, I'm not really... I'm not, I, I started to say that I'm not interested. Someone tells me, say, so it would take more offence to that now. After all, how could I tell her that clubs are a waste of time when she's starting a club of her very own? Actually, yeah. I think I've decided on a club. Really? Which one? Tell me. Hmm. I think I'll keep it a surprise. Boo. You meanie. I'm sort of like leaning my legs up over here. Right now. Be patient. I'll find out soon enough. I used to ask myself when I got lectured by such a carefree girl. But I started to realise, in a way, I envy her. When she puts her mind to something, she can accomplish great things. So that's why I feel like I should do something special for her. So is it just a normal game now? Is nothing weird going to happen? How many times do you have left? Like, you mean time? Probably like... <coughs> an hour at most. The school day is as ordinary as ever, and before it's over, I know it. After I pack my things up, I start gathering motivation. Let's see. I recall the room number from the club I just saw a fly from earlier. I walk across the school upstairs, a section of the school I rarely visit, being generally used for third classes and activities. Before long, I find the room. I timidly open the door in front of me. Hello? Ah, James. What are you doing here? Well, I just... I glance around the room. Huh? So you know what that James here is always talking about? <laughs> Thank you for stopping by. It's a pleasure to meet you. We're the Literature Club. I hope you enjoy your visit. Come on, Yuri. No need to be so formal. He's going to think we're really strict or something. Uh, sorry, Nagasuki. The tall one, whose name is apparently Yuri, seems to be quite shy compared to the others. In comparison, the guy named Natsuki, despite his size, seems like the assertive one. But it's nice to meet you both. I look forward to working with you. Working? Play, James, please don't tell me. You're. That's right. The club has decided to join your Yuri. The Literature Club. Series lies it up. Uh, eyes light, li lies it up. No way, no way. Ah, she wraps around me, jumping up and down. <laughs> uh, hey, <laughs> well if Siri is happy, then I'm sure it won't be too bad to have you around. Not to mention there's four of us now. This means we could become an officially recognised club. I don't know what to say. We have to celebrate. Hee <laughs> hee. What an appropriate day for that, isn't it? Yeah, after all, that's who you decide to. I didn't ruin the surprise. Eh, <laughs> sorry. <coughs> Everyone sit down at the table, okay? How about I make some tea as well? Oof, nice cup of tea. <sighs> Dink. I've got some desks arranged to form a table. Natsuki and Yuri walk over to the corner of the room where Natsuki grabs a wrapped tray. And Yuri opens the closet. Jeez, I'm always so tired. I'm always so tired. Still feeling awkward. I take a seat next to Yuri. The shower's still working. I haven't seen anyone say anything in a while. Just refresh it. There you go. Had some glitches with chat today, I will say. Natsuki proudly marches back to the table. Tray in hand. Okay, are you ready? Ta-da! Oh, uh, what? Still have the backup? I put it in the system files. Like I put it in the game files. Uh, hang on. Let's see if I do. No, I don't. Not anymore. <laughs> oh no, no I do. I've got it. I've got it. It's in the recycle bin, okay? <coughs> Monica is still here. I've got it. I do have Monica. What happens if we put Monica in there now? Should I do it? Nothing happens, you say? I'm going to put Monica in there. What if we just delete the people who are in here? 
Like, say we delete Natsuki, what would happen? Would the game mess up again? Natsuki lifts the foil off the tray to reveal a dozen white fluffy cupcakes decorated to look like little cats. The whiskers are drawn with icing and the pieces of chocolate were used to make ears. Nothing happens? Okay. So cute. Wow, those look amazing. Yeah, well, you know, just hurry up and take one. Siri grabs one first and I follow. It's delicious. Siri walks, uh, Siri talks with her mouth full and has already managed to get icing on her face. I bet you it's icing. I turn the cupcake around in my fingers, looking for the best angle to take a bite. As he gets quiet, I can't help but notice her sneaking glances in my direction. Is she waiting for me to take a bite? I finally bite down, noticing a sweet and full of flavour. I wonder if she made it herself. This is really good. Thank you, Natsuki. <coughs> well, of course it is. Huh. Interesting. Well, Monica's back in now. Weird. I'm a pro after all. There's no need to thank me or anything. After Natsuki struggles to accept the compliment, Yuri returns to the table carrying a tea set. She places a teacup in front of each of us. Actually, hang on, do I... No, Monica is in there now. Monica's definitely in there. Monica deletes herself. Interesting. Carefully places a teacup in front of each of us before setting down the teapot next to us in the cupcake tray. You keep a whole tea set in this classroom. Don't worry, the teacher goes for permission. After all, doesn't a hot cup of tea help you enjoy a good book? Uh, I, I guess. Here, are you trying to impress our new member, Yuri? That, eh, that's not insulted. Yuri looks away. Huh. I meant that, you know. I believe you. Well, tea and reading may not be past time for me, but at least I enjoy tea. I'm glad. Yuri faintly smiles to herself in relief. So James, what kind of things do you like to read? Well, uh, considering how little I've read these past few years, I don't really have a good way of answering that. Manga? <coughs> Yeah, we've read all this before. Like, we've done all this before. Is there anything new that's that's coming up fairly soon, Zeta? Or is all of this, like, exactly the same as what we've seen? Do you have to make new poems and stuff again? Because I'm starting to, like, lose interest in this game now. Hmm. <sighs> Is it all, like, the same stuff? Natsuki is gonna give you some. Not much of a reader, I guess. Well, that can change. What am I saying? I spoke without thinking uh, after seeing Yuri's sad smile. Anyway, what about you, Yuri? Uh, well, let's see. Traces the rim of the teacup with a finger. My fairy are usually... Novels that build deep and complex fantasy worlds. Level of creativity and craftsmanship behind them is amazing to me. And telling a good story in such a foreign world is equally as impressive. Yuri goes on clearly passionate about her reading. She seems so uh, reserved and timid since the moment I walked in. But it's obvious, by the way, her lies I tip that she finds comfort in the world of books, not people. But you know, I like a lot of things. Don't feel intimidated if you don't read much, okay? I'm certain we can find something that we have in common. Hey, Yuri. Eh, well, about you, you know, first thing he said, manga? That's right. Natsuki tends to read manga in the club room. <coughs> Natsuki will be the devil. I mean, yeah, I'm not a fan of Yatsuki. Y Yatsuki? Natsuki. Don't just say it. For some reason, Natsuki seems embarrassed about it. Besides, manga is literature too, you know. So if James wants to read some manga, then don't try and stop him or anything. I wouldn't do such a thing. However, it could also be nice for us to d d diverse d diversify? Is that it? D diversify ourselves a little. He could take this opportunity to try something new as well. Wouldn't you agree, James? Maybe, since Ascension Siri jumps in, maybe we can all try something new. I think it could be fun, and we'll all get to know each other a little better too. I mean, that's the kind of thing literature clubs do, right? I, I don't disagree or anything. Yeah, you're right as usual, President. Ooh, Siri's the President. Look at that. 
Eehe. <laughs> Guessing that means I should try picking a Medoval or something, huh? Well, that'll make two of us. I wouldn't mind doing it if I'm not the only one. Then as for Yuri? Eh. Have to read manga? Jeez. You only one who suggested we have to di diversify. You should be a little more open-minded. It's kind of hurtful. Hurtful? I didn't realise. Little gu guilty expression Yuri thinks to herself. I'm sorry for disrespecting your <laughs> interest. I mean, they'd be swearing at each other if it was if it was the previous one. Oh dear. You played the game. I oh I believe you, Zeta. I believe you completely. I feel like you've you, you've played this game back to back and and just know it like the back of your hand. <coughs> That's what it comes across to me. If if you're into it, then I'm sure it's worthy form of literature. Are you just saying that? N no. I've realised my error, so if you're willing to consider starting a novel, then I'll offer my gratitude by finding a manga to read as well. Really? I I mean, it makes me happy that you do that for me, Yuri. You can trust me to find something that you'll really like, okay? Same here. Perhaps I'll visit the bookstore after the club meeting. J just, just you? Uh, would you like to come along with me? Um, if you don't mind? Not at all. I'll, I'll always go alone, so yeah, me too. This is so cute. Yeah, Siri, shut up. <laughs> I'll show you some manga there too, okay? Yes. I look forward to it. Can I go as well? They didn't ask me if I could go. Can, can, can I go? <laughs> Please? I guess the meeting's over, huh? Yeah, it looks like it. That's nice to see everyone getting along, isn't it? I think everyone likes you, James. You think so? Well, everyone seems to get along a little better with you around, Siri. Oh, James, don't say something like that. It's embarrassing. Well, whatever. I wasn't surprised when you told me you were starting a club. But I think you're pulling off just fine. We're going to make the best club ever. Now you joined, every day is going to be so much fun. Hey, James, I really want to thank you. I mean, I'm really happy you joined the club and everything. But the truth is, I already know you're going to. <laughs> There's actually something else. Okay, this is kind of creepy. <laughs> <coughs> I want to thank you for getting rid of Monica. Who's Monica? That's the question. Nobody knows. <coughs> Who is Monica? That's right. Hello, M M Mugetashiro. What's going on? I know everything that she did. Maybe it's because I'm the president now. But I know everything. Cloudy, I recommend watching at a lower quality. So watching like 360p or whatever. You won't be able to see my face, but surely that's a good thing. Kappa. Yeah, try 360. Really, dude. 144p is the way to go then. 144p. <coughs> I would have thought your toaster has more pixels than, than 144p. <laughs> yeah, try 240, and if that doesn't work, 144. And if that doesn't work, get, get an internet, okay? Hmm. Or the, the the 160, whatever that is. I know on YouTube it's 144, but yeah, choose 160. Uh, 
forever and ever. F o r e a f e e. No. No. I'm bad with your name, okay? Can't read it. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on in the chat right now. Literally no idea. Respect FF OMG three one sixty is so pixelated. Oh. Oh everyone's doing like the forever thing. I got it. <coughs> okay. Uh, what's happening? That's alright, Tompos. That's cool. It's alright with lurking. I don't mind. What's going on? I don't know what's going on now. There's no happiness here after all. Goodbye, Siri. Goodbye, James. Goodbye, Literature Club. <laughs> I'll read it, okay, Cloudy? I'll read everything. Apart from that, I'm not going to read that. Okay, now the stream quality is going to get very low. I'll say that now. Because of the way that the streams and bit rates work, the screen quality will be low. Hi, it's me. Um, so, you know how I've been, like, practicing piano and stuff? And not really any good at it yet, like, at all. But, I wrote you a song, and I was kind of hoping that I could show it to you, because I worked really, really hard on it. So, yeah. special day. deleting itself in the credits. That's amazing. When a smile says it all And if this world won't write me an ending What will it take just for me to have it all? Is it deleting it in the game files? Is it actually deleting it? I can't see it. Where would it be deleting itself? Only write better words for those who are dear to me. <coughs> is it love? If I take your is it love? If I set you free? Sound of your heartbeat What do you call love 
in your reality and in your reality if i don't know how to love you i'll leave you be better not be copyrighted Yeah, better not be copyrighted. Oh dear. This is for my final goodbye to the Literature Club. Oh, I agree. Someone should chart that for Clone Hero. That'd be great. <laughs> like, the piano chart? That'd be great. <laughs> I'd love that. I finally understand. The Literature Club is truly a place where no happiness can be found. To the very end, it continued to expose innocent minds to a horrific reality. A reality that our world is designed to comprehend. I can't let any of my friends undergo that same hellish epiphany. <coughs> that was awesome. There is a chart for another Doki Doki song. For the other time it lasted, I want to thank you for making all my dreams come true, for being a friend to all of the club members, and most of all, thank you for being a part of my literature club. With ever after love, Monica. And the game just closed itself. That's it. Is that the end? Is that officially the end now? What if we open the game again? Oh, it, it just shows that again. It literally just shows that again. Look at this. Huh. That's interesting. So you now have to reinstall the game in order for it to be fixed. I like that. It's really cool, you know. Want to see an Easter egg? What sort of Easter egg? That was like a, a very, very pleasant ending. Reinstall the game? Oh, I don't want to reinstall the game. Mm, that'll take forever to do. <laughs> Even if it is, like, really short. Like, you know. I kind of want to not do that. Lunar game series? I've not heard of that. I think it's about time, though. I'm I'm happy with where we left off. I'm happy with where we left off, okay. We're gonna do the following. Look at this. Look at this. Right click. On Doki Doki Literature Club. All the way down. Uninstall. This will delete Doki Doki Literature Club game content from this computer. No, Zeta. This is the end, okay? Everyone in the chat say click as we click this button. You can't see me. Herp a derp a derp. Doesn't want to work. We're going to click this button. Click. Okay. It's gone. The game is uninstalled. And that is it. Okay, Zeta. Okay. Oh boy. What am I going to do now? What am I going to do now? Well, I guess that means tomorrow we're going to have to start something new. We're going to have to start something new. A new game series. Let's have a little look here. Let's go to, uh, to this screen right here. Look, it's all white. How beautiful. How beautiful. What have we got next, eh? What have we got next? Maybe this. Okay, it's, it's going too quickly. 
it's going too quickly. We're going to be playing this game next. This game is like a childhood game to me, okay? This game is so good. I'm going to be playing this next. <coughs> but with a catch. I know the video is broken, okay? I'll have to fix that. We'll be fixing the video. But if everything goes well, we'll be playing this game. We'll be playing this game. First DS game you played? Dude, it's such a good game. But we're going to be doing it different. It's going to be different. It's not going to be as you would imagine, okay? This is a randomized version, meaning with a separate program, I have changed and modified the game. Meaning we will get literally any Pokemon. It could be any starters or anything. So like, for example, we could have an Apom as a starter. We could have a, a Dialga as, as a starter. And we're going to be playing this next, starting tomorrow evening. Hope you enjoyed the stream. And I hope to see you when we finally start this game that is so amazing. And we're going to have a good, a good bit of fun. I need to fix my webcam though. And yeah, uh, Zeta, I will be um, looking at that after. Okay. <coughs> uh, I'm not going to do like a live react or whatever, because all this is going on YouTube is one big VOD, so yeah. I will see you all tomorrow. Goodbye.